I'm trying to chill. And and you know what I'm talking about if you're watching, Pharaoh. I'm trying to chill. But you know what I'm talking about. I'm trying to chill with another dude. I'm 50 fucking three years old, family. You hear me? <laughs> no, no, this ain't no joke. No, no, this ain't no joke. No, no, this ain't no joke. But as a kid, you know what I'm saying, Pharaoh? Don't make me go there. Because it's it's sad as a kid to get molested. That's sad. I don't want to go there. But but I know what's going on. I know people that know you. I know the troublesome that you went through. I know your mother's not in the house. I know you've been growing up without your parents there. Well, I know don't what's get going on. I know I about the of, molestation. Oh God. Hold on, hold on. I know about the molestation. And if you push me, I will prove it. I know about the molestation. And if you push me, I will prove it. And if you push me, I will prove it. I will prove it. So just, I'm trying not to go there. You know? This is the way, this is why you behave the way you behave. This is why you, you know, I, I say I give it another motherfucking um, two or three more years before you finally fucking come out the closet. I'm 50 fucking three years old, family. You hear me? <laughs> I give it a, a couple of more years before. See, I'm only giving you a little taste of how Sarnetta could get it in with you, nigga. Man, Pharaoh, a real man's man, Sarnetta. What you talking about? Nah, brother, yeah. that's what you think. You see the mask. <laughs> All you see is the outside. You see the mask. Don't no real man do the shit that this nigga do. So I'm, all you see is the outside. Better. All you see is the outside. Yeah. The fucking front. Okay? So, I'm, only giving, I'm, giving right. little, I'm giving you a little I'm giving you a little taste right now. What's to come in the future? I'm giving you a little taste right now. What's to come in the future? I'm giving you a little taste right now. What's to come? The, the people are now subscribing to buffoonery and all the stuff that y'all was accusing me of doing, y'all condone it now. Start in trouble now, y'all say that I was doing, but y'all missed the bigger picture, family. It wasn't about me starting trouble. It was about me bringing up information where the viewers would have the opportunity to say, damn, I agree with the Hebrew side. Oh, I agree with the, the Muslim. I agree with the Moors. Oh, I agree. See, y'all missed the play. Y'all keep dropping the fucking ball every time. You see what I'm saying? But what y'all did, you been you stepped on your brother Sarnetta's neck. You were stepping on me and stepping on me, but I'm still here. And I'm looking at this internet thing today, and now I see that everything that y'all accuse me of, y'all have become worse. And that's real talk. I, I know y'all don't want to hear it, I know y'all want to blame Brother Sarnetta for everything, but come on, family. I was bringing knowledge and information, regardless of what y'all say. Now you got these Negroes just talking about every goddamn body, and y'all love it. I'm looking in the comments. Y'all condoning it. Y'all congratulating them, talking about good work. And I'm like, for real? Good work? Because I could do that. I could get on here and talk shit about every goddamn body. Is that what y'all want? Do y'all want information now? Y'all gonna continue to blame your brother Sarnetta for this fuckery that's going on? I remember when I first started this, it was the viewers. Let me know if I'm echoing. Is it all right, family? Because I got on the headphones. Let me know if it's all right. I remember it was all about the viewers. You know, it was all about the viewers. And y'all was the one that was saying, nah, go check that. Y'all was doing fact checking and all of that. Now it's like y'all condone everything, all the fuck shit. Y'all condone it. Do y'all need to know about motherfucking scamming the same shit over and over in the community? How much? If you break, if something is wrong in your car, do you throw the whole car away or do you fix the shit? You fix it. You don't throw away the brothers and sisters in the community. You fix the problem. By you keep on 
just throwing salt on the wound, salt on the wound, we never get this shit fixed in the community. You understand what I'm saying? So, what I'm telling you, brothers and sisters, is that we have to move past this and get back to the information. I'm always finding myself dragged into the shit. Now, I'm not saying I'm no goody two-shoes. I know that, um, yes, I played a big role in this shit too. See, once I can admit that, then I could begin to move on. Yes, your brother saw another play the role in, this, in the fucked shit too. What I should have done was ignored a lot of people and just keep doing what I do. But I try so hard to include the viewers and ask them, what do y'all think? What do y'all want? Now look at it. There's no contention as far as the, um, the information being disseminated no more. It's a lot of Negroes popping up on YouTube thinking that they doing the work. And, and hey, family, the shit that really blew my mind yesterday was <laughs> I was on this page and the dude was talking about support my GoFundMe. So I goes to the GoFundMe and I said, are y'all for real? This dude had like about $900 on his GoFundMe page. And guess what it was? It was all about Oh, I'm exposing Brother Polite. Help me get more information so I can expose Brother Polite. And I'm saying, damn, is that what this shit is about now? You don't want to help me get the van? Because you know your brother Sarnetta is not going to let you down. I show you what I do. I'm out there in the street. You know? Never scam, never will, and never ran. I'm here. You understand what I'm saying? So the shit has become a circus now. And y'all support anything and anybody now. It's not about the knowledge no more, I see. That's real talk, family. It's not about the information and the knowledge. And just like I blame myself too, I'm definitely going to hold a lot of you, viewers, responsible. Yes, I know it's a big pill to swallow. Let me hit that motherfucking bomb right quick. I'm going to blame the viewers for this shit that's going on YouTube right now. Well, some say, damn, Saul, what you mean? You I'm with you. you. I got your back. Oh, I'm going to support you. I'm down with you. So you put the battery in their back. Family, you got to understand what I'm saying here. You put the battery in these niggas' backs. You see what I'm saying? Instead of you saying, nah, brother, like y'all do me. See, I love it when y'all do it to me. Nah, I saw another, you bigger than that. You don't need to do that. And I listen to y'all a lot. And I say, okay, the people don't want it. Let me fall back. Like I do. You know, sometime I might jump out the fucking fifth floor window. But then I come back home and start looking at the bigger picture to bring y'all the information again. And then I see the fuckboy shit again on other channels. And I don't see nobody stopping him saying nah bro y'all wrong why y'all doing that because believe it or not y'all damn there's gonna be a lot of goddamn bombs going off in this motherfucking day and I'm telling you move the kids away right now family cause this is not about um trying to be nice I gotta be Sarnetta I gotta be me you know so what I'm saying to you family I know a lot of you don't wanna hear it a lot of you don't don't get it but you got the power. Whatever you say in that chat room, the majority of you, they gonna have to listen to you. Or else what? I'm not coming back over there. I'm not listening to that, to that dead shit. I'm not listening to that death. But I see, I've been putting on a lot of great powerful information lately. And it's like, y'all don't want that shit no more. Y'all want the contention. Y'all want the he said, the she said, that nigga's a scammer. That nigga's a liar. Fuck that nigga. I'm the real man. I got the information over here. I think that's what y'all want now. Specifically about the house of consciousness with Sonetta. All right. The brother's been asking me for weeks, even to the point where we bumped heads the other day. I'm like, bro, come on, man. You can't handle your big brother like that, man. I'm like, nah, Sonetta. All right. The brother's been asking me for weeks. The brother's been asking me for weeks, even to the point where 
We bumped heads the other day. I'm like, bro, come on, man. You can't handle your big brother like that, man. I'm like, nah, it's not that. Like, nah, it's not I have to feel it in my spirit, man, in order to go before the people to let the people know that it's cool to get ahead and go. Because they've been hearing a whole bunch of stuff about you, about debates, about a whole bunch of stuff coming out of the House of Consciousness in New York. And some people just weren't pleased. And that's just real. The House of Consciousness, Consciousness is having a reunion celebration. August 13th. It's at the um, uh, Alhambra Ballroom. All right, let me get the address correct. I don't want Sonetta calling me up. All right, I don't want Sonetta calling me up. All right, get the address correct. I don't want Sonetta calling me up. Sonetta coming right. at you from the House of Consciousness, Sonetta TV. And I want to make it clear to my people out there that Ali Muhammad didn't cancel the debate. He I said it, it was canceled. I canceled the debate, not Ali Muhammad. All right? So I never said he canceled the debate. Whoa, anyway. whoa, whoa. See, I knew it comes. It comes. All right. This is what happens. All right, go ahead. I ain't gonna put that when, when black media no, listen, I'm gonna cut that part. adopts white taxes. This is what happens. All right, go ahead. I ain't gonna put that part. When black media no, listen, I'm gonna cut that part. adopts white taxes. This is what happens. All right, go ahead. I ain't gonna put that part. When, when black media no, listen, I'm gonna cut that part. adopts White taxes. This is what happens. All right, go ahead. I ain't gonna put that part. When, when black media no, listen, I'm gonna cut that part. adopts White taxes. <laughs> no, don't cut this out. Do not cut this out. <laughs> All right, People need to see you don't cut it out. Don't cut it All out. right, but no, Doctor. on a serious note, Dr. Ali Muhammad never canceled <laughs> oh, any God. of the debate. He never canceled the ISUPK, and he didn't cancel this debate with Polite. Right. All right, what I was doing was playing chess hard body, and I knew that I would get a response from him because look at it. He went on um, um, media calling me son nigga. I never disrespected <laughs> my brother, and I was still humble with him. I was still humble me. with him. You lied in the public on me. That's the right, my brother. Still humble with him. Me. I was still disrespect. humble with him. You lied in the public on me. That's the right, disrespect. My brother. You lied in the public on me. You lied in the public on me. Now that being said, bring him up. Kill him a goddamn kid because they didn't die hard enough.